we got the message loud and clear that plant-based diets are better for our planet and our bodies. That left one question unanswered. If animal products are so bad for us, why did we evolve to eat them? We tracked down Dr. Milton Mills, a physician who has lectured extensively on this particular issue. And, and currently what people believe is that when human beings moved out of equatorial areas into the more temperate areas around the globe where plant foods weren't available year-round, that it then became necessary to eat animal foods in order to survive. And that's when humans developed sophisticated hunting technology so that they would be able to make it through, say, the winter uh, months when plant foods weren't available uh, until they could then start gathering their plant foods more. And the other thing is that once we decide that something is either necessary or desirable, we enshrine it as a cultural value. And once it becomes part of our culture, it really doesn't matter whether or not it's necessary or important for survival. We'll do it anyway because, you know, we consider it to be Maintain necessary and important. Well. Right. So it seems that it was evolutionarily advantageous for humans to have as many food options as we could. And that's why we became omnivores. But now that so many people in developed countries have access to healthy plant foods year-round, we don't need animal products to thrive anymore. Because we're killing the planet with our growing meat and dairy habit, it has now become evolutionarily advantageous for us to adopt a plant-based diet. One forward thinker of the past century became vegetarian at the end of his life. He is quoted as having said, Nothing will benefit human health and increase chances for survival of life on Earth as much as the evolution to a vegetarian diet.